Welcome to programming again. This is um, video number 10. This is, I want to start a new series on how to make an um, RCP platform, which will stand for a rich client platform. I will call this an AI arena, which uh, will be an arena for AI agents and AI implementation. Um, it's kind of um, specialize in particular field so I'll show you what it is um, the system it's just uh, any application called AI Arena with an installer user can install it and hopefully I have a better icon than this and if the user decided to launch it the user will face with a window with um, initially have two windows two panels in it uh, I'll call this windows so the left hand side is going to be game explorer window the middle one is going to be game arena and you say why is the right hand side one the right hand side one is going to be the property panels so um, three components to the application and initially if just the platform the user will have AI arena game so intentionally I want a list of game. Game will be installed as a plugin, and any game plugin installed in here, it will list in the game explorer windows. So currently, I only have um, one uh, one base install with only one game, which is the AI Arena and each game will take control of the display canvas which is um, the whole thing in, in game arena windows and we'll have the property show in the right hand side for example the uh, AI arena will have its own property uh, the user can start a new game by clicking on this and pause the game by clicking on this and set the delay amount in um, milliseconds in this text view so on its own the platform is not uh, very interesting but if the user decide to install a new game it will can it can be done through the plugin manage uh, manager. The user doesn't have to uh, download a new platform or anything. He can just shoot to download the um, plugin, the game plugin. Let me show you the size of the plugin. Um, the first one I show you is the um, checker plugin, checker game plugin which is only 8k now if he decided to add the um, checker game he can do that basically by um, clicking on the file.nbm that bin module click on open and click on install next accept the license agreement and click install it's not signed but it's safe so, and click on finish it doesn't take into uh, it doesn't load the plugin right away so the user need to restart the AI platform now the user can see that um, there are two two games in here and the first one is the AI Arena, the second one is Checker. 
as you can see the checker game take con uh, takes control of the um, display area in here and also the property it just changed um, the name uh, the property is the same okay um, let's um, take a look at a new one adding a new game um, this time I'll add TTT which is from the tic-tac-toe game click on install accept it and um, continue finish close now TTT and BM is only 5k now t uh, let's take a look at it so uh, the AI arena checker tic-tac-toe this game um, will take con take controls of the um, game canvas as I told you um, and it's got the um, preference delay amount of its own and add it can add many property game property as much as many as you want to so you can add the uh, implementation of the player X uh, or the implementation of the player O and the user can restart it this it just to show you that um, what the series is going to be uh, covering so basically the series will cover how to make the whole thing and in addition to that I hope that I can explain to you how to use NetBean as a platform for your own application and this is the end of the introduction video um, thank you for watching goodbye